Guys, we are now in our hotel room, so I don't like the combination. The combination being that I was given two rooms, so there's a apartment with two bedrooms, and then another flat and another building, one bedroom. So I was like, um, but there's six of us. I thought we we're all going to be in one room. So they said, well, as at now that we've arrived, they don't have that. But after breakfast, I should come check with them tomorrow. They might be able to put all of us in a room. So we're just like, no, this two bedroom, we're all just gonna sleep here tonight. And then tomorrow I'll go and check. So let's do a quick hotel room. So. So guys, this is the bathroom. Bathroom. There. Hair dryer. Soap. Towel. Toilet. Walking shower as well. So I want to come out of the bathroom. This is the hallway. That's the door there. I don't know what is this is wardrobe. Yeah, these are wardrobes to hang your clothes. It's quite spacious. That's not bad. And this is one of the rooms. The boys are in here. Is the AC one? I was gonna come on it. I'll bring the remote. It is this balcony. There's one of the rooms, and then we've got a balcony. Balcony as well. The second room. Second room. So we've just done like a makeshift third. They've given us a third bed now. So we we'll find out tomorrow if we can get a family room. And then another balcony. So that's us. I just want to grab a shower. I don't like this view that I've got. Like, I've got like a back view. So I'm not loving it. But yeah, that's just that. Right, guys, I'm gonna go get a shower and then bed. Okay, I'll see you guys at some point. Good morning guys, it's, um, well, we arrived here, 2 a.m., 2 a.m. Turkey time, and 12 midnight UK time, and we could have been here earlier, but our flight was delayed, um, from London to, I mean, from Glasgow to Turkey, and then, upon getting to Alanya, I mean, to Turkey, we couldn't find our transfer vehicle so i intentionally booked a private transfer like a private luxury transfer to avoid going on a coach a coach that will now take forever so upon getting there i was expecting to see a driver with my with my name there was none there was no driver so apparently i was just like okay what do i do now so one of the guys were like oh who are you looking for so i gave him all of my paperwork and we're like oh this company that is meant to come collect you they are no longer in business they folded that they should be so he was able to connect and call the number for me and they were like oh that they will check and if they have my name on their list they will send me a driver and stuff like that so apparently there's a massive massive car park with all the coaches vans like massive car park so I was like, all right, okay. So we waited about half an hour, and for me, I kept going back to each of the stands. So there's like, if you book your, if you book your holiday through Love Holidays on the beach, they have like a stand, so you can go there. So for me, I booked our trip via Love Holiday. So I saw a stand, and I went to, to check, and they were like, oh, they don't have my name on the list. So at some point, eventually, a driver came with my name, and this guy very cool. It was fine. He, 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 he first of all took us on like the half an hour trip to get fuel. All of my mind were like, oh, we are now way to the hotel. Only for, you know, he got fuel and then he backed back again towards the airport. And I'm like, so he wasted half an hour. On a normal day, at the right speed, 
the transfer from the airport to the hotel should be maximum an hour for five minutes so for him an hour into the trip is very cool started there's a hazard light about seat belts that kept on so and on their road i was seeing 90 miles i want to believe it was 90 miles per hour and this guy was going about 30 miles per hour i was keeping cool but 20 minutes like you know what no i can't take this anymore right mr man and the annoying thing was that it doesn't speak english it doesn't speak english i was so mad and by then you know we were tired my kids were tired you know it was it was it was crazy so i was like you know what pull into the next filling station this journey should have we should be at the hotel by now and this was around just before midnight we should be at the hotel by now and we are not even halfway through with this speed that we are going so you know i told him to park the car into the next filling station and then i got down and i approached, approached a couple of guys and i asked like guys do you speak english and we're here and i'm like no i needed to speak to that guy that i don't want to go with this vehicle anymore I don't feel safe you know it's going 90 miles per hour and then in an instant it's going 30 miles per hour and cars were like other cars were starting to like you know beep and like boom 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 so at some point we're like yeah 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 so it was not speaking as well at some point the guys a couple of the guys came around like oh what happened did that so we i was told with the kids to sit down in a you know you know there's like a waiting area so we sat down there eventually another car came and we're able to get to our hotel in about so from that place where i where he stopped it was like an hour to our hotel from there so this guy got us there in 45 minutes so yeah we got checked into our hotel about just before two o'clock took a shower went straight to bed at three o'clock so that's me awake now so it's currently 7 22 in the morning i think yeah 7 22 in the morning so the kids are still sleeping one of them is awake so yeah the day is about to start and i'm just about to go get a shower and then go get breakfast and see what we could get done for today okay all right i'll talk this with you guys later all right all right guys so i'm about to head for breakfast this is what i'm wearing top from shein short from shein as well hat from primark and sunshade is vivian westwood don't know if you guys can see it sunshade is vivian westwood so um i'm gonna go to the i'm gonna go to the reception right now and my daughter is still sleeping there so um, there's breakfast between seven and ten o'clock but i want to go there early so that i could find out if we could get a massive like a bigger room because the other room that we're given is not in the same building as we are right now and there's no point you know been in here we've already paid for that one and i i would have loved if they put us in the, like in one apartment and secondly i don't think the air condition is working so right now i'm roasting yeah i'm roasting so hence why i want to go for the early breakfast so i'll talk this with you guys at some point all right so breakfast Did you find your way out easy to get here? <laughs> right, guys, we've sorted our tummy and we're gonna go back to the hotel to meet the girls and bring them back. So they said they wanna come back for late lunch. I mean, for late breakfast, we'll see. So, people are lounging here. It's gonna take me a while to find my way around here on my own. So, you, you are the one leading the show now. And then maybe once we once they finish having breakfast, we can go and we we'll get familiarized with the area. That's safe, bro. Uh, want to go in there for like peace and quiet? You can go there. What's the temperature now? We wait. So we are the block tangerine and then we go left. Hi there. Hmm? Alright guys, I'm with my oldest son here, Simon. Oh my god, the sun is burning. <laughs> the sun is absolutely burning. So I'm with child number three. 
So we're going to go to the reception just as I told you guys earlier on. So, yeah, that's, that's where we are. Where is the way? Is that the way? I don't know where we are going. Are you sure this is the way? <laughs> how, did you, how did you remember from yesterday? Yeah, so heading for breakfast. It's currently past 8 or something. It's not 9 o'clock yet. And the sun here is like Nigerian sun. Like 40 degrees Nigeria. That's how the sun is right now. And I can feel it on my skin. So this reminds me of when I was in Nigeria two years ago. So, oh, look at that car. <laughs> this one is not scared of anybody. Well, okay, I guess I would talk back with you guys later once I get to the reception, alright? Guys, I'm with the kids. They are heading off to go eat breakfast. And the sun is sunning. It's sunning. This thing is not working. Yeah, I'll join you guys. Good morning. How are you? Hi there. Breakfast buffet. Breakfast buffet. Guys, we are going exploring, so someone's coming. Oh, we forgot the sunscreen again. Very well, thank you. How are you? <laughs> Soon. Soon, yeah. All right, guys, it's lunch time here currently. Um, 12.56 it's time to go for lunch and I will see you at some point once I get there like this AC is cooling me down this AC is cooling me down and I'm loving it so yeah, I actually had a shirt I wore a shirt underneath this dress but I took it off because the, the like the heat outside is heating so yeah time for lunch and I need a snooze I've not had the proper sleep yet so yeah I'll see you guys at lunch Alright guys, look at that cat. We've had lunch and we're just going for a stroll. We're going for a stroll. Because after food now, the next thing I want to do is bed. So the resort that we have, there's four other hotels and they all bear the same name. But they kinda like so the hotel name and then a different thing by known by a different thing, but it's run by the same hotel. So we want to go kinda like you know feed our eyes and see what's there and then get back into that room and enjoy the air condition like the air condition is banging 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 so look at them they're hiding they don't want to be in my videos apparently one of my son's friends at school found my video and since then you know what happened with kids so yeah we're just gonna walk around and once I get to the where things I will show you guys where it is um, we are looking to book a couple of um, trips and stuff, but we don't know what trips we want to do yet, but we'll figure it out. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Oh, it's hot, 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 hot. It's hot everywhere. Alright guys, we are heading for dinner. So this time, dinner starts at 9, 7 till 9. But my girls uh, went earlier on to go see if they could find a seat for us. You know, there's six of us. Well, there was none. I think the weather is much better now. It's not as scorching. 
So yeah, we're just going to hey, we're just heading out to go get dinner. And then I'll be trying to sleep because I'm I don't think I'm I'm not I've not slept well. I've not slept well. So I'm gonna get fed, take a couple of minutes walk and then back again. And I'll see you guys once we find the table. Okay. So that's other places, other hotels. Yeah.